Now, when I designed this out in the computer, I didn't allow for the fact that the 10 gauge steel, which is approximately an eighth of an inch thick, was going to mean that my pieces were going to actually end up being a quarter of an inch longer. So that means that in order to have the spacing between here and here exactly right, I have to have the ends of each one of these pieces sticking out a little. And as long as it's going to be sticking out uh, on here and here and here and here, it may as well stick out everywhere else um, so that everything sort of matches. At least that's the plan right now. And another thing I want to remember before I start welding everything together is that it's a good idea to drill all the holes now. For instance, I need a hole here and here to fasten this piece down. Like this piece here is actually this little piece right here. And I have to be able to fasten it down. So I should drill all my holes first, in other words. So being as I'm going to be wanting to clamp this down to my wooden workbench, I, I want screw holes here and here. And then when this whole thing is flipped up the other way, I want to have maybe a, a hole like here and here. Uh, at least that's the plan right now. You know, I always wondered, what was that triangular shaped thingy for? Now I know. I fully realized that I would have royally failed welding 101. I know that I over welded, but I needed the practice, obviously. And we're just about done here with the welding except for the two bolts that have to hold the top to the bottom. I'm going to weld them on the bottom rail. And uh, then I guess it's a case of go over it with the rotary wire brush and the flap grinder and uh, yeah, we're ready to paint. Well, okay, I know what some of you are thinking. You're looking at that paint job and you're seeing all the running and slumping and you're thinking, he'd fail painting 101 too. Okay, I would. However, let's wait until that paint gets nice and hard, give it a few days and we'll get the tank mounted in there. And I think it's going to look okay. In the meantime, thanks for watching. <laughs>